WHO has been on the case on tobacco for, for many years, many decades, in fact. Um, and it has something called the Tobacco Free Initiative, uh, which has recently been renamed the No Tobacco Unit. Um, and there's a, there's a problem even in the naming, because most of the trouble comes from um, smoking, not just tobacco itself. So there is a, although it's focused on tobacco, the real issue is smoking. We'll probably come back to that. Um, the Tobacco Free Initiative or No Tobacco Unit is part of WHO's Health Promotion Department. And interestingly, WHO defines health promotion as the process of enabling people to increase control over and to improve their health. Now, it's very interesting because tobacco harm reduction, vaping, smokeless tobacco, heated tobacco products enable users to do exactly that. Yet so far, they've received nothing but opposition from uh, WHO. So there's an interesting conflict in what WHO philosophically defines as health promotion and how it actually practices in the area of tobacco control. Now, the, the No Tobacco Unit does a lot of interesting things. It, it's in charge of World No Tobacco Day every year on the 31st of May. It produces advice on taxation. Uh, it sponsors the TOBREG Committee. And TOBREG is like a scientific advisory committee, but it's recently, for example, uh, suggested the banning of open systems. Um, to be honest, without much justification. And it has opined on things like uh, Ivali uh, with quite bad scientific advice, in my, my opinion. Um, it also publishes statistics, uh, including every two years, uh, a publication called the uh, Global Tobacco Epidemic, um, in which you know it sets out what it sees as the problems and the policy response and so on. So it's providing reports and information guidance on things like uh, how to implement tax, to do litigation, and, and so on. Okay. It doesn't actually run the framework convention on tobacco control. Um, now, that, that's a surprise to some people, but that's now a separate entity, although it is housed within, F, uh, within the WHO's headquarters. Mm -hmm.